Oh, so I can't see that bird, but uh, there's a robin singing over there. And uh, I'm here at my GP surgery uh, a bit early this morning. Uh, we're doing flu jabs and COVID jabs for people. I was just listening to the birds on my cycle ride, mostly robins now, I'd say. Probably like 70% of what I'm hearing is, is robins. They just carry on over the winter, uh, late autumn, winter. Uh, get the odd wren, so have a look back at maybe the wren video I did. Um, but uh, there was an article sent to me um, yesterday, which was published in the Times. Uh, and um, it was an investigation by researchers from King's College London. And they uh, were basically looking at birdsong and mental health and showed clearly that um, birdsong improves your mental health, even if you just tune into it uh, a little bit. So, yeah, whether you can name the birds or not, I just encourage you today to spend five minutes, ten minutes outside, have a little listen, see what you can hear. It's probably most likely to be the robin. It's not, an e it's not the easiest song to kind of know what it is, which is why I, um, I've left it a little while. But... Uh, have a little listen, see if you can tune into it. It's got this kind of silvery ring thing kind of going on. That kind of woo -woo -woo -woo. Kind of hear it there a little bit, as well as a car in the background, maybe. Um, yeah, so we're giving COVID jabs today. Closest thing to acquired superpowers, in my opinion. And uh, yeah, the other thing, just in terms of thinking about COVID and entering into the winter, we, um, we've we got um, good evidence from the Zoe studies done by Tim Spector's uh, company that the bigger diversity of whole plant foods you eat, um, you're less likely to get COVID and you're less likely to get sick from COVID. So thinking a bit about your physical and your mental health today. Um, so have a good one. Enjoy it. See you later. Bye.